Congratulations, Steve. Another 1 0. Yeah. But you don't look happy. No, um, I thought first half we were total control of the game. Totally mm -hmm. should have been, you know, 2 3 4 0 to the, to the good. And I always said to them, second half, these teams are going to come out, they're going to give it everything, and they're going to get an odd chance here and there. And we're scrambling about a little bit. And in a game that we should never have allowed them to be in, they were totally outplayed, outclassed, outfought everything but they gave their all and they went to the end and it made an exciting end to them not yes. for me yes it was ner it was ner nervous ner nervous for, for no reason yeah and, um, and the boys know that and know on certain terms that the second half performance unacceptable we haven't we haven't scored a goal in the second half this season so that i imagine you've reminded them of that that the second the second halves in general have not been as strong as the first half. yeah What's you, the can, you, for can, that? you can nitpick on loads of things, but mm. at the end of the day, it's another win. It's another clean sheet. Another clean sheet the other day, so we, we're scoring Absolutely. goal. And we're fourth in the league. Yeah, but I don't look at league tables until probably Christmas. Right. Okay. Um, as a manager, you know, they change week in, week out. You can go from tenth to first within one game. Sure. So it's, it's, that's not important for me. Sure. It's just it's another step in the right direction. Um, you're seeing lots of positives, and then you were seeing a few ne negatives from my point of view. Um, uh -huh. Switching off and taking a foot off the gas second half. Right. Um, picked up a, it looked like a, an injury or two today as well. Um, yeah. Um, Melvin Kamara went off, he looked in pain. Yeah, he looked like he's got a dead leg. Right. Um, I think Boovey looks like he's tweaked his groin. Uh huh. Um, and Cady? Cady looks like he's, he's hurt his knee. So he, right. Cady looks the more sort of serious one. Right. So I, I don't envisage that being more than a couple of weeks though. Oh, right, so he won't be able to play against Hendon, you're pretty no, sure of that. No. That's a shame. That's going to be a, a very big game now. They're yeah. top of the league. Yeah. They they're, haven't they're lost going, a game yet. Yeah, they're going well. I know the manager well there. Yeah. Um, a friend of mine, and he's had a good a good start. But he'll know and I'll know. There's a start, there's a middle, and there's an end. And sure. That's where you end up, it's not where you start. Sure, I get, I get the feeling you feel that we're not firing on all cylinders yet. and that. <laughs> no. uh, no, that frustrates the hell yeah. out of me because I know what players we have got here for the level we're at, mm -hmm. and it frustrates me when we can give, you know, very very good performances first half, and look very very good and class above, yeah. and then drop off second half. Sure. I'm very disappointed in, in in that, and they know that. Sure. I mean, I remember the first 25 minutes of our pre-season friendly against Hampton and Richmond, <coughs> and we looked like world beaters then, yeah. and, and I haven't quite seen us play with that intensity since, to mm. be honest. Yeah. you say that's fair, or am I being uh, unduly harsh? Unduly harsh. I'm, I'm I think very pre sorry. pre-season friendlies are different to, uh, to um, actual points on the board, mm -hmm. to get points, you know, the, 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 the tackles are different, the intensity is different, the... Um, there's something at stake when you're playing yes. a, when the league game friendly. It, it doesn't mean anything. You win or lose. So yeah, they're different. Different tenses. They mm -hmm. they don't close you down as quick in pre-season friendlies. You get time to pass the ball around, and everybody wants to beat us. It's, you know, the bookies have made us one of the favourites to win it. So every time we step on the pitch, that team wants to beat us. So it's mm -hmm. almost playing against twelve men um, because nah, they want to turn us yeah. over. So we've got a, a little bit bit of time off uh, this week. A, are you training on Wednesday or Thursday? Thursday. Thursday. And then for the Hendon game, I imagine you'll be uh, asking for a bit more from your squad. Yeah, but like I say, they've given everything so far and I'll keep winning games, not playing the whole game well. Um, you know, we're a work in progress, as I keep saying, and if we can keep winning when we're, when we're playing just OK, then sure. that's a recipe Listen, for, for good things. When you've been in a famine like we have, this feels like a feast, can you? Yeah. So uh, uh -huh. I'm very happy. Yeah. No, it's our it's third win in a week. Absolutely. So nine points from possible 12 is, is a very good start. We cannot complain. No. Thank you very much. Cheers. Have a good uh, remainder of your bank holiday. <laughs> Cheers. Cheers, King. Bye -bye. Love the shoes, by the way. <laughs> Fabulous. Thank you for that. And um, here's a little bit of a view of Horsham's ground. It's not the dripping pan, is it? <laughs>